What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to G Miles World. Shout out to all of you guys that checked out that monthly weekend league reward. Um, a lot of you guys felt so sorry for me. I appreciate it, man. It was a very, very wild uh, Fire Fantasy pack. For those of you guys that have been playing Madden for a while, you know that those Fire Fantasy packs usually are so goaded. But in all, in, in all, in all fairness, bro, I pulled two Redux Deion Sanders back to back uh, during that Blitz promo. So I didn't expect to get that crazy, but. EA pretty much gave me the highest card as an 88. That was kind of wild after a whole month of just dealing with this right here as we jump into a weekend league game. And if you are tuning in and you saw the title, you know that Eric Dickerson is about to go crazy. Now, let me specify what makes Eric Dickerson so good in this game. Um, not only does he start off with Freight Train, which is the best ability to start off with, um, he's very, very fast. He's bigger. He has stiff arm. He has spin. He has all that stuff, right? So right off the gate, right off the gate, we're going to go score right out the gate and as you can see the, the one thing that i really really like about his card once he gets out in front and just make sure you guys understand this he has to have full stamina once he gets out in front you are not catching him from behind the same thing with sanders as they kind of tuned it and i like that they did it because prior to the last uh you know patch everybody was getting caught from behind i have yet to be caught from behind by a d tackle when Deion sanders is out in front and he burns everybody. The only time that he'll get caught is if you had a couple runs before and he came in like slightly yellow or slightly green and didn't have full stamina, then they'll let the players catch him. Other than that, you're not gonna catch these guys. And that's a really big deal because many of us understand that the way the game goes, you'll be running back to kickoff on the left side of the field. And how many times does this happen? You're right, you're about to get right into the end. Oh, that was a nice read, guy, good, good read. Um, you're on the left side and you're running straight up. And then out of nowhere, a guy from the right side just comes and catches you. And the guy that you're returning the kickoff with is Deion Sanders with a 97 speed. Nice pick right there. We knew this guy was blind, but I didn't know he was just going to throw it right to me like that. But good stuff by this guy, though. But this dude, Eric Dickerson, though, you see like how he breaks that first tackle? The interesting thing about this game is I don't think I'm going to lose uh, my X Factor. Like, I, I think, oh, get, get off me. I, I really don't believe, that's the second touchdown, by the way that I'm actually gonna lose my X Factor. This is one of the uh, rare games where he doesn't lose it. Usually at some point, you get tackled behind the line because EA doesn't want you to keep it the whole time. So they make some kind of fluke thing where a guy just screams for no reason and runs right through and tackles you in the backfield and you lose it. Another interesting fact about this game, Barry Sanders doesn't get one carry. And I don't know if you guys noticed, I don't even have an ability on Troy Aitman because I've been actually thinking about raid selling Troy Aitman again. Yeah, I know, it's kind of mean because I've already done it four times, but he's used to it at this point. Um, so there were a lot of things that I was trying to figure out what I'm gonna be doing um, you know, with this game, actually. So as we go through it, I wasn't expecting it to turn out the way it's gonna turn out because not only does he score five TDs, uh, Eric Dickerson, but this guy, I don't even think this guy scores. And it gets really, really weird uh, throughout the gameplay, but I thought I would just kind of like explain certain things to you guys as we go along. With the NFL 100 players that are going to be uh, getting released, we have the corners, we have special teams, right? A lot of you guys are talking about Charles Woodson. Some of you guys are bringing up other players. I'm going to just try to break it to you easy. Some of the players that you're you're saying um, are going to be eligible for it, They um, the NFL has already released pretty much a finals list. So if you go to NFL.com, you'll be able to see the finals. And a lot of the names that you guys are talking about are not even on the list. So more than likely, you won't get one of those cards. I just want to kind of break it to you guys easy. Uh, that'll be probably something that uh, you guys can check out. But later on, uh, on you know Friday, December 6th, I think it's about 9 Eastern Standard Time, EA Sports is going to be releasing the new NFL 100 players. So definitely take a look. Yeah, okay, dot me then, dot me. What? Who, is that Aaron Donald I was running around with? Oh, that's why nobody got pressure. I was running around with a D-tackle. Okay, that, that, that's realistic though. I like the fact that they didn't, oh, oh, okay, okay. You don't got no hands though? You don't got, uh, hey, I bet if there's a hamburger, you'll pick it off. All right, so look at this again. All right, yeah, good tackle. Who is that? That was a good tackle by this guy. Um, uh, ultimately, what's, yo, this, yeah, he didn't block him? What? Oh, oh, okay. Okay, yeah, we out, we out, we out. So now we're just gonna score our third touchdown. So it's starting to get out of hand. Now, usually when this starts, oh, oh, okay. We'll be play, playing basketball at his mom's house? Yeah, give me the ball, give me the ball. Yo, bro, you gonna be disrespectful and press the button though? Like, while I'm trying to show these dudes I'm playing basketball at your mom's crib, like she got the whole basketball set up, like you just gonna press the button though? Let me just explain this really, really uh, quickly, right? Eric Dickerson's price, it's probably going to drop in like two weeks because we're gonna be very, very close to 
getting a, a free card, an NFL 100 free card, and they aren't, to my knowledge, letting that expire. For those of you guys that don't know about it or you're watching this video as your first video, all of us are gonna be able to get one free card. And the solos at this point have not been expiring, so I think this is gonna be something that EA is gonna promote uh, during Christmas, but people that get the game during Christmas to be able to get a free 94 overall. I would urge you guys to wait it out. Okay, oh, whoa, whoa, that was Madden 16 action. That was some Madden 16 action. I would wait to kind of, you know, be, you know, okay, he, all right, just throw it to my user. To make sure after everything drops, because I think some of you guys may want to go after that Randy Moss, even though, like I said, it's really a run meta game. Oh, we going for six. We, we definitely going for six. Like this night, this dude right here, he doesn't even care anymore. Like, okay, whatever, run for six then, run for six Denzel Ward. All right, show him how you walk to his mom's crib. Show him, show him guys. All right here. Ooh, that's how my legs be. That's how my legs be when I be walking to his mom's crib. Bro, you see, bro, you see how I'm walking on an angle? That, bro, that's how I walk when I'm going up the stoop to go knock on the door to his mom's crib. Like, I just wanted to share that with you guys, bro. Like, why is Denzel Ward so disrespectful? I have no idea, but that's not what this is about. W what this is about is this. I didn't even want to log in, but I got to log in because I'm going to need to get those um, trophies for what's going to be coming with Series 4. Now, for those of you guys that don't, uh, you know, pretty much don't um, have a lot of trophies right now, or you're contemplating whether you should get rid of your trophies and start from scratch, I kind of explained it to you. And when I say kinda, I gave you a choice. Usually I just tell you, like, do this, but I gave you a choice. And the choice is, if you get rid of the trophies that you have now for touchdown packs and get 65K per 220, you're probably going to be better off and then grind for it in the new series. That way you have currency, because if you do not do that, you are going to be, re oh, okay, run it for six. You're going to be really, really down and out to start series four. And that's what I don't want. A lot of you guys are like, yo, I got a little bit under 100K, I got 70K. You guys are flirting around with bankruptcy. So I would probably go ahead and take those touchdown packs, get the coins, and see what drops early. Because remember, it's a bunch of Redux cards that are coming out. So all those limiteds, all those other cards that you just couldn't afford before, they're going to be available as Redux, which is gonna also drive the market a little crazy. And you may have a little bit of more, you know, a little bit more freedom in getting some of the cards you actually wanted. I, bro, is this guy serious? Like he's throwing the ball right, like this is not even, I'm not even making this up. Like he's throwing the ball right to me. And it's, who, who's blocking like that? That dude's crazy. All right, let's get it then. You know what I'm saying? John Madden excited, everybody excited. Let, let's get it then. Like this dude right here, he's crazy. Is that Eric Dickinson again? That's number four? Was that number, yo guys, let me know. Write it in the comments. I think I lost track. Was that number four uh, for his touchdowns? I'm not sure uh, because I've been, I know that we got some defensive touchdowns, but I just know we scored five. So make sure you count it up. And if it's five, at the end of the video, just write five so I know it was five. And maybe my math is off, you know what I'm saying guys? But this dude came out to get fully dominated and we're just gonna have to do him a service, bro. Like sometimes you run into these dudes where they're like, I'm not quitting no matter what. And you gotta give them the service, bro. And the service is just complete domination for no reason. Oh, okay, whatever, who's that, is that Julius Peppers? Why did he just scream like, oh, Ju oh yeah, okay, all right, all right. Yeah, this guy right here, man. This guy, okay, Night Train, take him a sip. Oh, Night Train got crazy spin, bro. Yo, oh, okay, yeah, I forgot that he got crazy spin like that and crazy juke. And he got hops, too. Like, Night Train, pick your moms up and do her in the dark lane, though. All right, so I think this right here is number five. Um, okay, no, it's not number five, because we got stopped, but this, is this number five? Okay, Johnny Five alive? Like, bro, what's going? Okay, so that should be number five. Then we're gonna go ahead and just make sure we get a fifty burger because you guys, you know, you guys recommend that we do fifty burgers around here. Like when you're dominating, a lot of you guys like when I do the fifty burger action. So there you go. If you wanted a fifty burger action, if you think it was too much, right? Yo, God, yo, you could have took it easy on them. You know what I'm saying? You could write, you know, too much. If you wanted a fifty burger, just write fifty burger in the comments, bro. Like I gotta know the kind of savages I'm dealing with on the channel. Like just in case. You don't want me to really dominate um, this type of way. You got to let me know in the comments, bro, because I'm going to do it anyway. And I told you guys, bro, did he just break through all that stuff? I told you guys to do it also, because when EA turns and flips the switch, guess what's going to happen to us? We're going to get dominated the same way. You can't care, bro. Like you got, oh, OK, where are you going with this, though? Where are you going with? Throw a dot real quick. Throw a dot right there. Yep, that's perfect. That's perfect. You got all the time in the world, man. You got all the time in the world. You pitch in the tent. You're doing anything, bro. Do was farming. Like, yo, what? Is, I don't understand why my defense. Okay, there we go. There we go. That's better, LT. Like, I don't know what you were just doing before, though. Okay, let somebody scream. Okay, pick it. Let's run it for six. Run it for six, then. Run it for six. Yeah, we out. We out. We out. All right, cool. Yeah, this dude right here, man. Like, he he's a glutton for punishment, but I got to give him a lot of credit. The dude knows how to take it, bro. Like, 
I, I've never seen anything like this. Like, I haven't seen anything like this since I played Draft Champions and EA was just all over me and I was screaming no. And they were like, yes. And I was like, all right, you got it. Like, I've never, bro, this domination is crazy. And again, that's the fun about the game and that's why I like to have fun with you guys. You know, I run into a lot of you guys that watch my videos um, and we play whatever. And you know, it's hilarious because we all know, we, we can know based on the first play if EA is gonna take care of us or not. And if EA is on your side, there's nothing that anybody can do. Like, it's a wrap. But this dude is still trying to fight. He's running the ball down 57. He's fighting. I don't know how he's fighting, but that's what he's doing. I guess that's what he's doing. But ultimately, he's going to try to DC the game and lag it out. Um, it's it's fine because we did get the win, which I'm going to show you guys. I just urge you guys. I'm going to give you guys a pointer about some of the things that happen when you get lagged out. A lot of you guys are anxious and you press the button, right? Do not press the button when it lags out once the game has started. Um, because sometimes it registers quickly and then either you get a loss or you don't get the win. So what he's going to do right now, it's going to start lagging out. You see, once this starts to happen, just let it happen and you wait, right? Now, when the screen comes up that it shows that the connection to your opponent has been lost, don't press anything. Just leave it alone. You leave it right there the way it is. The game automatically does it for you. And then if you have to bring up another screen, it'll bring up something like that. And then you have to select, um, you know, how you felt about the performance. But don't press anything with the disconnect screen. Because if you press it too fast, sometimes it registers wrong. You don't get the win. You get a loss. It gets crazy. You guys start tweeting me at Gmiles World. Yo, what's up? Can you get to EA for me? And then I handle my business and make sure I, I submit it for you guys. And everybody's happy. Except for us, I had to go through a whole game and didn't get credit for it. So that's pretty much what it is right there. Eric Dickerson is a beast. If you don't have him, I would recommend you grab him. If there's anything else you guys want from the channel, let me know in the comments. Stay blessed. Until next time, one love.